Hi, my name is Angela Huffman. I'm a dealer and an educator for the APQS Long Arms for Lifelong Learning Center. I'm going to show you a filler design today that is called Candlewick. It looks a little complicated, but when I break it down, it's got some basic shapes that you should feel pretty comfortable with, and you can build it up to be your own design. We're going to start out with a lowercase e. And when you get to the base of that lowercase e, you're just going to put a leaf shape around it. And now we're just going to do little daisy petals around that leaf shape. And now I'm down here at the base, I have a couple of choices. Right here at the base, I could flip over to the other side and fill this out, and I think that's actually what I'm gonna do because I do have some um, space I wanna fill out that's close to that bottom edge of this block. So let's go ahead and put some daisy um, leaves, uh, loops in there that will echo around the shape. And now I'm ready to kick out and do a second uh, lowercase e, another little uh, lowercase e with a leaf shape around it. I'm just going to make sure that I go in a different direction. So I'm going to actually point it um, up uh, to the opposite way I just did this first one. So there I finished my little uh, leaf with my lowercase e in the center. I'm going to put my daisy um, petals around it. I'm down here at the base, and this is where I have that choice, where I could cross over my stem and fill out around it, and I think that is actually what I'm gonna do because the space between these two leaves is a little um, skinny. Now I want you to notice I have some negative space here. I need to work myself around, so I'm just gonna use um, some echoing around my daisy petals to get me out of this area so that I haven't kind of blocked myself in. And now I'm ready to kick out and do another lowercase e with a le uh, leaf shape around it. I'm gonna go pointing down this time so that it's opposite of what I've already done so I can mix up the direction. Now here I am at the base, and I'm actually gonna go around this time the opposite way. So we had been kind of crossing over that stem, I'm gonna go around the opposite way. And when I get down here into the base between these three elements, I just want to echo myself out of this space until I have enough room to put in another leaf shape. So I'm just going to echo out. And then I'm going to just do a smaller uh, lowercase e with a smaller leaf around it to fill in that negative space there at the bottom. And then I'm going to put my daisy uh, loops around it. And then I'm going to echo out of here to fill in these spaces. And now I'm going to echo out around the daisy petals for this neighboring shape until I can get to a new space to put another lowercase e with a leaf around it. And then I'm just gonna keep on going and fill in these areas as I go. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel so you're notified every time a new video is posted. If you'd like more information about APQS machines, visit apqs.com and be sure to like us on our Facebook page. We'd love to have you join the conversation and we'd like to see what you're working on.